Morning, guys. Rusty Myers here. And dude, I just want to give y'all like a little moment of hope this morning, like a pastor does. I ain't done that in a while, so I decided I was going to do that this morning. It's lift people's spirits in America. You know, as a Trump supporter, I know pretty much everything there is to know about religion. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to be protesting a peaceful protest. You know what I'm saying? At Hobby Lobby today, because apparently, you know, there's going to be a, there's been gay people throwing pink dildos through the windows at Hobby Lobby. So, and the police aren't doing nothing, so we just need to stand our ground and be like, we ain't going to stand for it. But basically, that's what I give y'all like, you know what I'm saying, my favorite Bible story. And, you know, it, I was watching Duck Dynasty like, last night, you know what I'm saying, the reruns of that show. And that was kind of like, if you think back to Adam and Eve, they were kind of like the original Duck Dynasty. It was like a you know, reality TV show, just for God, though. You know what I'm saying? That was Basically, you know, Adam and Eve, they lived in the garden, you know what I'm saying, and Adam, I guess, he'd been tired. You know what I'm saying? They were both naked anyway. You know what I'm saying? In West Virginia, we call that, a, you know what I'm saying, a, a cover dish dinner. You know. Eating fruit naked. You know what I'm saying? But I guess Adam had been, like, feeding some deers and cutting up some cantaloupe. And so I guess Eve was, you know, he took a nap, so she wanders off. And apparently there's this black snake. You know what I'm saying? Bob don't say it was black, but I'm just assuming it was. You know. Um, and so he tries to offer her an apple. And like Stephen Furtick said, he didn't really, that apple must have had drugs in it or something. Because, you know, Eve was white. Adam and Eve were white, you know. So I guess she was wandering out there. She was bored, you know, because he'd been working all day. And so she comes up on this black snake, you know what I'm saying? And he's like, I got an apple for you, you know what I'm saying? Girl, I got something for you. And so, you know, I guess, you know, that, you know, one thing led to another. You know, and I guess she went off with the snake and, you know what I'm saying, ate the apple. You know what I'm saying? Probably the banana. So, and then she got back to Adam, and she's like, you want to try this apple? He's like, no, I've been sober for two years. You know. But anyway, they both ate the apple, and so God made them put underwear on. You know what I'm saying? So, basically, you know, that's pretty much exactly how it went down in the Bible. So, I hope y'all enjoyed this morning's moment of hope.